Lucky Bell. Hey, Percy, catch. I got it. I got it. I think. Awesome. Nice catch. Is that your Lucky Bell that I hear ding, ding, dinging? Sure is. I had a scary delivery to the top of Cannibal Curve. So I brought my Lucky Bell. My bow always gives me a little bit of courage. Well, I feel super boosted right now. I'm about to make my first delivery to the old mine. The old mine? I hear it's really dark. And has cool rock formations. And scary creatures. And super windy tracks. And it's so deep, it might not even have a bottom. <coughs> huh? Gordon, you look like a train wreck. <coughs> That's because I was just <coughs> at the old mine. Hey, I'm going there now. Well, be careful, Thomas. One slip off the old tracks and you could fall into who knows where. <coughs> Told ya. Bottomless. Wow, I, I didn't realise the old mine was so scary. <gasps> hey, Percy. Do you think I could borrow your lucky bell today? Gee, I don't know, Thomas. It's really special to me, and I'd be really sad if something happened to it. I, Thomas, promise I won't let anything happen to it. OK, but you've got to keep it in your cab. Thanks, Percy. Will do. And it can't get wet. Roger that. And it can't get hot or be in direct sunlight. And it likes having a nightlight while it goes to sleep. <laughs> it's going to be OK. I won't let anything happen to it. Starting now. <laughs> Thanks again. Oh, and it doesn't like loud noises. Wow, the old mine is even older and minier than I thought it would be. And darker, darker. and scarier. <gasps> That's right, I've got Percy's lucky bell. With this bell by my side, nothing can go wrong. Let's do this. Thomas promised Percy I would be really careful with this bell. Oh, 